the umbaria i don't sleep outside landslice road is blocked this is the road see cars park down there see this is the road the road are blocked Yesterday, because of heavy pre precipitation, there was landslides and the floods. The river Momo of our floods is banks and inundated many of the valleys and the floodplains. Many houses have been destroyed. People are in need of relief. At the moment, uh, the mayor is about to create a management disaster management committee to take care of the super affected. And some have died too. On the other hand, there was landslide on the Tiben Hills, uh, blocking the international highway um, Babenda Indigo Corridor. And the mayor has deployed uh, workers to clear off the debris, and the hours ahead there will be circulation. And then in the other part of uh, the Makansi area, beside the Eka village, landslide has swept a, a house and killed two persons inside. They are all female. One is about 50 years, Angor Priska, a Cuba, 50 years old, and the other one, still female, of about 72 years, known as Angor um, Christina. It's very unfortunate to join from the council area at the moment when things are very, very difficult. We are trying to mobilize to see how we could provide solutions to them. Some relief to the, those affected. Some of this comes as a result of construction in disaster prone areas. Yes, because uh, some of them, we the, most of them are built there without um, uh, building permits. They are built in on on, on floodplains, on swamps, and uh, the tendency of, for them is to pray to God, think that uh, God will come to intervene to help them during during a disaster. Those will also build on slopes so, uh, at risk of, of landslide. That's what happened in what happened in Eka. So at the moment now, the mayor is thinking that. Uh, uh, a uh, management committee, disaster management committee, is going to go into force to evict them from there by force to relocate them to where they had earlier been relocated in 2012. Because